Hello YouTubers, beer geeks, and beer hounds alike. Bill here. We're going to do a beer review. All right. So, we got one here from Beechwood. Um, their real name is Beechwood Brewing. They're from Huntington Beach, California. This one's called Peak Pursuit IPA. Coming in at 7.1% 7.1% alcohol by volume and 60 IBU. Uh, let's see here. It's got a little literature there. Um, no mention of the hops. Canned on date of 12 6 23. So, um, damn. This thing's like two weeks old. Okay. I got uh, four pints of this at Whole Foods for like 15 bucks. This is what the can looks like. Let me bump this up a little bit. There we go. All right. That's what the can looks like. And here's the literature. If you want to pause it, you can pause it now. Read it. Okay. Oh, here's the hops right here. Shoot. All right. Missed it. The malt is American two row. And the hops is Citra, Mosaic, Idaho 7, HBC 586, Equinox, and HBC 682. So this puppy's loaded with hops. Cool. Um, never had this before. Never seen it before. Nothing. So let's handle it. Been very impressed with this brewery thus far from the beers I've had from them. So they're doing some really nice work over there in Huntington Beach. Right up the street from where I live here. Okay. Let's do a photo shoot real quick. Good looking beer. All right. Quality control looks good. All right. So the head looks tight, frothy, creamy, and silky. And a pretty darn clear, kind of like a light gold color okay very nice looking very clear just a very slight haze to it not much at all looks good okay get some more in there Okay, check out the aroma. Wow, it's got a nice dank pine, kind of hot, uh, pine oil kind of note. Like a lemon zest, lemon oil zest. A lot of floralness coming through. Very piney, floral, and like lemon zesty. A little bit like uh, marijuana oil. Smells super good. But a really nice, really high quality pine note. Really good smelling. Man, I might have to get another. I think I'm going to go ahead and get another uh, photo shoot busted out here because that looks amazing. Yeah. Check that out. Definitely going to go for it again. If I can get it quickie, quickie, quickly. There we go. 
awesome looking. So, smells like an extremely good pine bomb with a lot of crazy floral notes going on. And that kind of like lemon zest, almost like dish soap kind of note. Smells awesome. Cheers. Mm. Oh, yeah. Really good. Really good. Super floral piney. Dank. Not like green. Not like the fresh green. It's like the oil, like the condensed oil kind. Really nice. Mm. That's amazing. Really good malt backbone backing all them hops up. Man, they nailed it with this one. I'll be picking up more of this for sure. This is awesome. It's got a medium mouthfeel. No booziness or nothing like that. Ooh, that's, that's, that's an amazing West Coast style IPA right there. Super memorable. This one's memorable. Oh, my God. Wow. Nice dry finish. Really nice lingering hop notes in the back end. Mm. Wow. That is amazing. I don't know how they're getting all these flavors, but unreal. Even the burps taste good and piney. Damn. Hop oil. Hop oil. Fresh hop dank oil. Mm, that is awesome. Uh, that's pretty much what I got on this puppy. He's got some head retention going. Nice little lacing on the glass there. I'll swirl it one more time. See if I can get some more notes out real quick. We'll wrap this puppy up. I'm very impressed. Ribbit. Sorry. Yeah. It's it's a it's a pine bomb, but with some really nice floral notes to it, and that definitely lemon zesty kind of note coming through, lemon oil. Awesome, Beechwood man, they they impress me. They continue to impress me. They really do. So, with that said, on a scale of one to five stars, two and a half being C average, I think this is awesome. I'm going to give a 4.9 out of 5. And that's my story. I'll stick with that. So hit the like if you'd like. Hit the subscribe if you'd like. Hit the little ball, bell for notifications if you choose the latter. I do appreciate you all. Have a great day. Catch you later. Cheers.